Hey there guys, how's it going? I've got a short video for you today, just for the kind of C star enthusiasts among you out there. After the success of the 3D printed buying off masks that I've been making and selling on my eBay and Etsy stores, those things have been selling like hot cakes guys, so huge thanks for your support with that. Made the task of uh, supporting myself a lot easier this last month. Thank you. I've had a lot of people asking me the question, can I come up with something to safely hold a filter in place? And the answer is yes after very 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 much time spent uh prototyping <laughs> throwing away lots of different designs uh, i've come up with one that i am finally happy with i think it's a good product even if i do say so myself it's not going to end up just in the bin in a week's time it should last and it should protect your filter ultimately it's a two-part clamping design with thumb screws uh, it should be completely non-marring to your filters or the c star itself it is just a friction fit as you can see once your uh, filters in place the whole thing just clamps into the c-star by push fitting um and it works well you know what i mean it's just as you can see i'll just take it apart for you i'll probably run a video alongside this but a pair of thumb screws and there you go it's a two-part system a filter arrester to actually hold your filter and then a sliding face plate to take multiple sizes of filters you know because they're not actually all exactly truly the same size and thickness so this should fit just about anything as you can see your filters held safely inside and you just clamp down with the thumb screws uh, everything's held in place and uh, snuggled nicely in there and should be uh, should be good and safe now I say it should be good and safe. I just want to clarify, you know, this is an experimental part kind of thing. Uh, I'm going to be making them available for sale at as reasonable a cost as I possibly can manage given the printing time of these things. Um, it takes up quite a lot of actual machine time. But anyway, that aside, um, they are, you know, use at your own risk. I understand people want to use these things. I don't know the first thing about um, what kind of nanometer of... Uh, filter you're going to be able to get away with and still stack using the c-star um that could be one consideration but other than that also you know accidents happen it is just a frictional fit and it could technically be knocked out it is held in pretty good but it could absolutely be knocked out if something happens so uh use at your own risk i just want to say by the way as well uh, obviously a huge thanks to everybody who's been purchasing my 3d printed goods it really massively helps to keep me afloat every month to be honest um alongside all the you know the youtube and patreon support and that kind of thing it all helps and thank you all but i just want to let you know about ebay and etsy in particular um a recurring problem i keep seeing and that's the delivery estimates on those sites are just way too optimistic to be quite honest with you um it's a site-wide problem it's not just kind of me affected by it but all international shipments it seems are arriving literally at least a week late unfortunately uh, there's nothing really i can do about it without charging astronomical shipping and i want to try and keep things as economical as possible because uh i try and do all of my printing in-house you know what i mean everything that you see on those stores is printed by me packaged by me and posted by me um i, I don't sell my designs or anything like that so uh yeah basically guys expect slight delays if you purchase one of these things but i absolutely will make sure one gets to you and if something goes wrong and you want a refund or another item sending or anything like that just get in touch and i will really will bend over backwards to actually try and help you and uh, ultimately get you happy with your purchase so uh yeah that's about it thank you for your time thank you as always for your support i just want to let you know that i've got tons more videos planned I'm just held up by the weather. I don't want to put out kind of half baked content anymore, really. I want to just make better videos uh, that are more worthy of your time because I respect your time and that's all there is to it. So, yeah, look after yourselves. I will catch you in the next one. And until then, <laughs> with any luck, clay skies.